guys, it's Addie and welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a back to school supplies shopping haul and a what's in my backpack. Okay, so starting off with the most obvious things is my backpack, my lunchbox, water bottle, and I think that's it. So starting off with my backpack, um, this is my backpack for this year. It is a little dirty because I used it for like the last quarter of last school year but this is a north face backpack it's just teal and it has black in it and i have not filled this at all so i'm going to be filling this at the end of the video onto my lunchbox i am getting a new lunchbox from amazon so i'll put a picture right here of what it is this is also my lunchbox from last year it's that brand this is from amazon and yeah it's like insulated on the inside for my water bottle, I'm actually getting a new one this year as well, so I'll put a picture right here. It's this Stanley. I don't know which color it is though. Um, this is my water bottle right now though. It is also a Stanley. They're both 30 ounces, but this is the cream color one right now. This is the one that I have right now, and I'm going to use for the beginning of the school year until my other one comes, and then I'll just switch out in between. I also do have one more thing, which is my pencil pouch. This is the pencil pouch that I'm using. I also used this one last year. This is the brand. It's also from Amazon. It has three pockets. This is the first one. The middle one is just a big middle pocket. And then here's the last one. It has these two pockets and then these two. On to the actual school supplies. Starting off with paper, I have this um, college ruled paper. This is 150 pieces, and I'm just gonna use some of this this year. Next, I have some graph paper. This is some graph paper from last year. Then I also have these index cards. They were for my English, but um, this is 100 index cards. And it's just um, the regular up and up brand from Target, I think. Next is folders. I'm only using four folders this year and they are all one color because I love having one color folders. They are all whites. I got these two today from Target. They're like the newer. And then these ones I already had. They're just the um, mead also, but they don't have like the little gray tab at the top. I do have seven periods and um, my first period is Spanish. So for Spanish, my teacher requested a three ring binder. So I just got this half inch binder. It's super small. And then she also asked for some dividers. So I got these dividers from Target. They looked really cute. There's five of them. So I have five dividers. On to some things that I already had. I already had these scissors. I've had these scissors for a while now and they work perfectly fine i already had these erasable highlighters so they're just like regular highlighters but they have the little eraser on the end i'm only bringing one sharpie this year i have all of these markers these are also the two ended ones they have a felt tip and then they have like a thin end pen one here is a glue stick that i already had i already have my wired earbuds and then I also already had this 40 pack of pencils from last year. Okay, back to actual things. Next is these post-it notes. These are actually from Dollar Tree and they work just as great as regular ones. They come in five different colors. Yeah, this first one is at an actual post-it note, which is from um, me. I put it in there. So technically it comes with four different colors, which is yellow, pink, blue, and green. Next, I wanna get more into like reading and like um, marking my pages and quotes. So I got these post-it note page markers, which comes in a ton of different colors. So I'm excited to use these. This year, I'm trying to like stay on task and get good with my schoolwork so then I can um, pass all my classes and all my exams. Next are just some colored pencils because one of my teachers or a couple of my teachers wanted colored pencils so I'm going to use markers and colored pencils. Then I already had this from last year but it's a pencil sharpener so this I can sharpen my colored pencils whenever I need to. Next I was at Target and I saw these super cute pens. 
they're the essential speckle gel ink pens and refills they are so cute eight different pens and gel ink refills next are some more highlighters because i love highlighting and taking like those little like girly notes i guess you could say um these are the mild line mild liner creative marker highlighters i had these um two years ago but then I didn't use them last year, so I now use them for my Bible study. And then I'll also have some for my actual school. And they do have a like thick tip, like a, they call it a chisel tip, and then a bullet tip. So you can highlight with one end and then write with the other. Next are just some black expo markers because I needed some for my class. And finally, I love writing with like colored pens and just stuff like that. And I also love Paper Mate. So I got these Paper Mate pens. They're kind of like squished, but still, I love these. Then one of my teachers wanted us to have a ruler. Random, but I got a flexible ruler so I could just like stick it anywhere in my bag and it won't damage. Then I needed a notebook or a composition notebook. So I got this decomposition book. Um, it includes 100% post-consumer waste recycled pages. And the outside is so cute. I was about to get like a basic pink one, but then I saw this one and I was like, okay, I have to get it. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. But yeah, I'm obsessed with this one. Then, like I said earlier, I want to stay organized and on task with all my schoolwork this year. So I got this planning calendar. It is super cute. Then it has a tab for each month. It has July 2023 through June 2024. Okay, on to like little, I guess, essentials. I have this mini native deodorant. I got a new one because I used my other one for my belt bag and my competition bag. Then I am literally known in my family for spilling things on me. So I decided to get this Tide pen just in case I need it. Then I got this mini wet brush. A lot of people have this and it's so, so cute. And I don't want to bring like a full hair brush. So I just got this mini one. Then Finally, I cannot go a day of school without gum. Watermelon gum from the extra brand. I always get the jumbo packs. These things are so good. So I had to get two because I know I will literally run out of this in like two weeks. I am going to organize my backpack and I will be back after that. Okay, so I finally finished putting everything together and let's just say it's a disaster over here. Okay. I forgot that I was going to add this white claw clip right here. I need to fix these front strands, but I'll do that later. But let's start with the front pocket. Here's the front pocket. It has a lot of stuff in it that I still have not organized. Over here, I am literally addicted to Jolly Ranchers and gum. So we have these, those two right there. Then I also have this Vanilla Bean Noel um, antibacterial hand spray. So that also goes on the side. Then in school, um, we're not allowed to have our phones out, so I won't be filming a lot, but I will put my phone in here. And next to it is a black Expo marker. Then is the Tide pen right here. And finally, I have all of the Papermate pens just sitting right in here so they're easy access then in this back pocket is just little essentials I'll just leave that pocket for like my phone and stuff but it's just this little bag it has a mini wet brush um i do have a couple of different of uh, hair ties because sometimes i like others i have this green one or like mint and then i have these two black ones um they're different like styles of hair ties and then i have the mini deodorants i have another hand sanitizer this is the watermelon lemonade one and they're both from bath and body works then i have this eos chapstick and then 
this Vaseline chapstick because I'm a very picky person and sometimes I like other things at sometimes. And then I'm also gonna put my Aquaphor in here when school starts. I decided that I'm not going to use these highlighters this year or these markers this year. By the way, um, I'm also gonna put like um, perfume in like the front pocket. I just don't know which one yet, so I'll probably like get that um, later, like the first day of school. Finally, in the big pocket, on the top I have my pencil case and this is the front. I have one of the Papermate black pens. I have a Sharpie. These, um, I have three different colored pens. I don't know why, I'm a picky person. And then three different colored pencils. In the main pocket, I have literally all of the highlighters. And then I have my scissors, my colored pencils, a glue stick, and my pencil sharpener. Over here, I'm also gonna put a book in here, so that'll just go somewhere. But in here, I have two different types of sticky notes. I have this green sticky note and then this pink one. And then I have the blue, orange, pink, purple, and yellow book tabs. And then my wired earbuds right there. The next thing on the side, I have my ruler right here. And then down in here, just at the bottom, is this little container. And it just has my index cards in it. So I'll put like a book down in here. And then I have my planner my composition notebook this is for earth science and then i have my algebra one folder in front and this is in like my class order um my english folder my world geography folder and then my earth science folder i do have spanish first so it would go in front of algebra one but i don't really like that i have my binder which when you open it up it has all four five tabs over here and i haven't labeled them yet because i don't really know what to label them and then i have regular paper and graph paper then in this back pocket this is gonna be my chromebook and then my chromebook charger will also go in here i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you want to see more videos make sure to like subscribe and turn that post notification bell i'll see you guys next saturday at 5 p.m est bye <laughs>